here today to talk to you about the South Central Pennsylvania Regional Action Plan. And I know I provided each of the commissioners with a copy of the executive summary as well as, as Jamie got one, uh, I believe just yesterday. Uh, South Central Regional Action Plan was uh, born out of the South Central uh, Pennsylvania County Commissioner's Caucus in 2007. And they launched, uh, the County Commissioners launched this planning effort to facilitate inter-county communication uh, on common development trends and investment needs and basically to solicit multi-jurisdictional -jurisdic support for regionally significant projects. Uh, our eight-county region consists of Adams, Cumberland, Dolphin, Franklin, Lancaster, Lebanon, Perry, and York counties. And that region is actually home to almost two million people and in that area, we have almost, uh, well, actually a little over 300 municipalities. And our region generates over $72 billion in annual uh, regional productivity. And that happens to be the third largest in the state of Pennsylvania behind the Philadelphia and Pittsburgh areas. So obviously we're a pretty significant part of Pennsylvania. And uh, this plan was developed uh, with funding from five state agencies, the Department of Community and Economic Development, PennDOT, DCNR, uh, Department of Environmental Protection, and the Department of Agriculture. And the plan itself took three years to develop. Uh, my predecessor as the, the planning director, Earl Meyer, was intimately involved with the development of the plan. And the plan process included over 100 key stakeholders and getting uh, input from those stakeholders as well as the county commissioners from all eight of those counties. The goals of the Regional Action Plan are, are fairly succinct. Uh, they are to improve the productivity and competitiveness, competitiveness of the region, uh, to retain and attract a more diverse workforce, and third would be to enhance choices among quality of life services and amenities. Obviously, when we're talking about competitiveness and productivity, we're talking about looking at our human resources, our capital resources, and our natural resources, as well as investments in transportation, the environment, tourism, uh, workforce development, and technology. Uh, the plan implementation is going to be the responsibility of, uh, of the uh, Regional Action Plan Committee, which will be consisting of planning director from each of the eight counties, as well as one representative, one non-voting representative from each of the funding agencies, which would be five state agencies. And what they would do is basically they would identify, evaluate, and prioritize regionally significant projects. And they would take those projects to the South Central County Commissioner's Caucus and ask them to elevate those uh, projects to the top of the list and also at the same time would we'll be asking those state funding agencies to elevate the projects to the top of their funding list. Uh, just as an example, some of the, the projects that were mentioned in the plan uh, would be, uh, for instance, the regional transportation study to facilitate inter-county transit, um, Colt and CAT working together to put uh, together efficient bus runs from Lebanon to Harrisburg or from Hershey to through Lebanon. Uh, and we're already doing some of those things, but this identifies that as a key project which the state agencies can assist with funding. Uh, another, I, another example project would be the Chesapeake Bay cleanup strategy. Obviously that's a huge, huge project that none of us can tackle alone, but as a region, we all have very similar uh, contributions to the Chesapeake Bay problem, and therefore our, our role in the cleanup can be unified and, I think, more efficient if we work together rather than in a vacuum and work individually. And there are a host, whole host of other sample projects uh, in the plan and the executive summary which you've already seen. Um, what I'm asking of you today would be basically to adopt the Regional Action, action Plan and initiate the Regional Action Plan Committee, which again would, would consist of the planning director from each county, and uh, at the same time, appoint myself as the representative to that committee. And, and I will note before I open it up for your questions, uh, 
Commissioner Litz and I had a discussion on this yesterday, and she raised a very valid point. Um, in this day and age, transparency in government is very important, and nowhere in this plan is there a component for the public to be involved with these decisions. And I went back through the plan as well as through Earl Meyer's notes last night, and uh, she's right, it, it doesn't appear in any of, of any of the documents that I have. Uh, obviously not having the background of being involved with the development of the plan, I don't know if that was discussed. Uh, my recommendation would be that we have not only a personal invitation to each of the commissioners to come to each of these regional action plan committee meetings, but that we also advertise them to the public and uh, solicit public input at the meetings. I mean, that, that would be my recommendation uh, beyond what you see uh, in the plan and the executive <coughs> summary. Which you can do that at your meetings. I'm sorry? When your group gets together, if we approve this, you can do that at the meetings. Correct. Bring those things up and uh, see what they want to do as a group. Correct. A better question is, what if they don't want to do that? Or, or do we, where do we well, stand? We go with the majority. Yeah. I, I, you know, I, I do go to all the regional meetings mm -hmm. when I'm at the county commissioners' conferences because they're held at, over a noon lunch, and so I think the projects and the ideas are great, but I just, you know, want to. And, and you're telling me that you will follow through on the transparency end of it. I don't want to do things in a vacuum. I want to make sure that the public has a chance to comment. So I'd gladly make the motion to support this um, plan, uh, providing they come up with a public option of some sort to participate. Well, what, that's what I just asked. What, what if they come up with a public option and vote it down? What if Chris takes it there and they vote Chris down? That's what I'm saying. Well, my motion is that we support it with no, the... You said as long as they came up with it. Right. As long as they come up with a public option. A to vote on the public option, not option. Not well, I've, from my perspective, I'm not going to vote to put any, let's say, strings attached to the, 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 the suggestion here. And let, let him take that back to the group and do it. So I'm not going to second or, or, uh, or, or vote in favor of doing that. I'm willing to, to give this a chance the way that it's uh, presented. And I, th I don't think it's a bad idea. I think it's a good idea, but I, I'm also willing to go along with what the majority of the group uh, is willing to do. And I don't know why they wouldn't do it, but who knows? And you have my commitment. But I'm not interested in putting any any caveats into the into the motion. Okay. Well, John has a motion on the floor. I do have a motion on the floor. Do we have a second? There's no second. Okay, I'll make a motion that we do uh, adopt the plan as uh, presented today here by Mr. Troop. I'll second. Any further discussion? All those in favor, consent to saying aye. 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 Opposed? I, as much as I believe in this plan, without a pub public option guaranteed, I, I can't support it. It has to have a public option. Okay. And with Robert's Rules of Order, if you would find out that they do have a public option, can I change my vote? Yes. Okay. And at, at, a, at a subsequent meeting? Yeah, I think so. Okay. I, don't I mean, they do that in, in the House and Senate one. I watch PCN, but I didn't know. That's, that, right. <laughs> that's where I saw it. That's why I said yes. <laughs> that's why I don't, I don't know if it applies here, but well, I'm they thinking. Don't, they don't follow any rules. <laughs> I mean, 